All right, just sitting at the coffee shop here, and I figured I'd do a quick video on how to automate things in Studio One really easily. So, what I have here is just a drum beat and a bass. So, if I hit play, you hear that? And I have this synthesizer I put on top of it, which I'll unmute now, and it's very plain sounding. What I want to do is liven that up with some automation. So, in Studio One, in any instrument, if you right click on a knob and go under automation and hit edit, it will put a little dot there, which now means if you go back to your track, you have this blue line, which is essentially that knob. And if you move it up and down, it's like you're moving the knob up and down. So what I'm gonna do is just go about halfway in. So put the knob about halfway. And I'm gonna draw another point at the end and bring that all the way to the top. And now if we look at the instrument when we play it, The knob is moving. Check it out on the line. And if you want to make your synth sound a little extra shiny, put some reverb and delay on it, bump up the volume a bit, listen to that. Cool, huh? And you can actually take this line now and do whatever you want with it. Draw points all over the place, go up and down, pull in, cur pull in certain curves, and really make your music interesting. Let's see how that's. And that's how you automate knobs and parameters in Studio One instruments. See you guys next time.